Hello and welcome to the fourth video in this um, series of um, file system uh, video tutorials. Uh, my name is David Thorner from Thorn Web Design. In the last one um, we talked about making and removing directories. Now uh, we obviously want to know how to be able to rename a directory too. So let's move on. Uh, just as I showed you before, uh, let's just show you here this is the actual uh, contents of the HTTP docs folder at the moment and what we will do is we will go ahead um, once again and make a directory so if um, I'm going to say if not directory I'm going to say uh, CWD and do a forward slash and then YouTube once again and we're going to make then the directory and would rather than typing this out every single time, we're going to say path. There we go, and we'll just say path here, and we'll just say path there. Okay, it's just saves us a bit of typing. If it's not a directory, then we're going to make the directory. Okay, so now once the directory is made, we're going to rename the directory. Okay, so. Prior to us renaming the directory, we want, to, we want to make certain that the directory actually exists. So it seems kind of redundant us doing this once again, but um, just for the sake of, of clarity. So, but if you're going to call this rename function to rename a directory, you need to make certain that it exists already. Okay. Now, what we do want to do is we want to have the old and new. Okay. So uh, let's say new path is then going to equal to um, YouTube new okay and that's what we're going to change the name to so realistically speaking if directory exists we want to know that this one does exist and what we also want to check is is that the other one doesn't exist already okay so we want to check that the new path does not exist because we're going to be renaming this one folder this one directory to then be called this so we want to make certain that we're not changing it to a name of a directory that already exists already okay so we then do this by saying rename now it's then the old one then the new one okay so essentially all we're saying is is that rename this one here to this one here which is what we're doing we're going to be renamed to YouTube new and once that is done we're then going to say if um, is directory a new name whoops uh, new path sorry and uh, not is directory path and we'll just say echo um, the renaming was successful Fizzpil. okay <laughs> there we go so um, it, it's very very long winded you definitely don't need to write all this code but I'm doing it just to show you clarity alright so we can just put here echo uh, we will now rename the folder stroke directory and the renaming was successful okay so let's go go for it and let's execute this okay uh, we will now rename the folder directory the renaming was successful so um, let's then just ll this and as you can see now YouTube new has been um, has been created and renamed as well all at the same time in the same script all right um, that's essentially it I mean you can then go ahead and, and move directories as well um, but this one was just about renaming um, directories now rename the rename um, function um, renames anything basically so if you've got a file you can use that to rename it if you've got a folder it will rename it as well okay so it it's it's basically re rename the old thing the new name okay that's all it is but you need to make certain that the first argument exists and the second argument doesn't exist all right so when you otherwise you're going to cause cause yourself problems so just make sure you do the relevant testing um, that you test that they do and they don't exist prior to um, calling this one function okay because it's a bit embarrassing having uh, error messages sent out and warnings sent out 
to your um, your viewers and so on. Okay, um, that's it. it. Was very very short, sharp, quick, uh, easy, uh, no brainer tutorial. Uh, but there we go. So my name is David Thorne, Thorne Web Design. Um, subscribe, uh, like, comment, contact me, send me any feedback, anything that you think that I've missed already. Um, if you think I've missed something already, then please look forward to see the other tutorials to see whether I've actually uh, made the videos already. Okay, that's it. Otherwise, have a nice evening. Goodbye.